Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are now further separating from William and Kate, moving away from Kensington Palace and into a new home at Frogmore Cottage in Windsor. Is Harry and Meghan's new Instagram account a hint the princes are continuing to grow apart? Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's separation from Kensington Palace is well underway, as the royal households divide. Kate and William will remain at their home in London, while Harry and Meghan are moving to Windsor. Royal sources claim the core reason for the move is for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex to raise their child away from the spotlight. The royal households will now be using different staff, and now they have social media accounts. Prince William and Harry once shared an Instagram account with Kate and Meghan at Kensington Royal. The official account documents the royal family's official business, including outings from each of the so-called Fab Four. Now, a new account named at Sussex Royal will focus solely on Meghan and Harry's working life. This likely means the royal couples will be participating in fewer events together where they would be present as a group. The separation of accounts is believed by some to be symptomatic of a larger rift developing between William and Harry. Documentary Royals at War which aired last month in the UK saw royal experts reveal the princes are growing apart. Royal biographer Katie Nicholl explained on the Channel 5 show how Meghan has backed Prince Harry's bid for independence. As Nicholl said, Harry has wanted to strike out on his own and I'm sure Meghan has encouraged that. I also know that they want to raise this child away from the spotlight. I think it is the end of the Fab Four. The staff will also be separated, you will have courtiers who work for William and Kate, and you will have courtiers who work for Meghan and Harry. That makes sense, their careers and roles are moving in different directions. While the two households are seemingly separated, they will still be under the watchful eye of Windsor matriarch Queen Elizabeth II. One royal source revealed, they wanted their household to be entirely independent of Buckingham Palace, but were told no. There is an institutional structure that doesn't allow that kind of independence. The feeling is that it's good to have the Sussexes under the jurisdiction of Buckingham Palace, so they can't just go off and do their own thing. 